is here for the Super Bounce Battle Royal. Oh, wait, whoa, wait a minute! Here. It's Tommy Dreamer! And wait look who a it minute. is! It's the GCW World Champion, Blake Christian! Don't get any ideas with that title belt. Justin, oh, good God! Springboard! Four! Rhino! Four! Rhino is here, and you gotta expect somebody's getting split in half! Gore! Gore! <laughs> yes! Background there. Oh, Blake Christian! Blake Christian eliminated. Now we've got Tommy Dreamer and Rhino. And Maurice the Strong. Oh, second. Dustin, I, I, you and I are both sitting here observing. Dreamer over the top and to the floor! He's out! Gore. Can he hit it? Nobody home. Rhino in a predicament here. Wait a minute. And Rhino he's eliminated. Gone. We've got a winner, Terrence. Memphis Wrestling. Folks, it has been an incredible past two weeks, but as Dustin said, today is going to be an action-packed, adrenaline-fueled thrill ride of a show. We've got a title on the line, the Cobra Cup Finals, and so much more to deliver this week at Super Bout 3. Will the gun show be available and prepared to fight the monster and regain and recapture his Memphis Heritage Championship scores will be settled. And speaking of that, our opening contest has it all on the line. It's the finals of King Cobra's Cup, and it's up first. Ladies and gentlemen, it's bell time. I'm loved by few, hated the by The following many, contest is our opening bout, and is the Cobra own. Cup Finals. Introducing first, from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 222 pounds, the genetic nightmare, Mike Anthony. Mike Anthony, kicking off week three of our Super Bounce Spectacular. Not many people are more decorated than Mike Anthony, the genetic nightmare, the self-made savage. Ooh. The capacity crowd chanting, show knocks gonna whoop you. Former Memphis Heritage Champion. Former Memphis Trios holder. Former Cobra Cup winner himself, Mike Anthony. Can he recapture lightning in a bottle? We're about to find out. Show up. <laughs> and look at this. And introducing next, his opponent. From Little Rock, Arkansas, weighing in at 387 pounds, the master of Fajitsu, King Tooman. Not a butt in a single seat here at the Wrestle oh Center. Oh my God. And Mike Anthony with a big suicide dive. This match is jump started. I would say get a camera on King Cobra. He's here. He's got the King Cobra Cup. This is what it's all about. But these men did not wait for the bell. Thank you, Cobra. You saw it in the background briefly. King Cobra handing over the trophy here at the desk, the Cobra Cup. This is what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen, King Cobra's Cup. And it does have power. The winner of this oh, match. Oh, 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 speaking of power. Gets King Cobra's Cup. Mike Anthony. Oh, my goodness. Big power bomb on the edge of the ring. Arguably the hardest part of the ring. Now the power of King Cobra's Cup. The Ooh. winner will have a championship opportunity. Anytime, any place, all they have to do is trade in King Cobra's Cup. And that is what's at stake right here in the opening contest of Super Bout 3. Bell rings and now we are just now officially 
underway after Mike Anthony with a brutal dive over the top rope. What's Mike doing here? I don't know what Mike is doing. He's pulling away from the referee. Mike's got the referee saying no. Now this match is started. Big kick to the face. Kate Toomer is in the grasp of the genetic nightmare. But look at the strength of Kate Toomer. And look at the agility with a big kick. There have only oh, been. Oh, you're a nice suplex. Down goes Mike Anthony. Oh, wow. Did big you see kick. that kick? Mike Anthony eating that for sure. The referee is checking to make sure that Mike Anthony is still conscious. He is hanging on to the referee for dear life. Saying, do not ring that bell. Meanwhile, Kate Toomer scaling the rope. I guess he had if a little bit of a change of thought. Oh, only God. for a minute. Maybe soften up Mike Anthony a little better. There's no telling what Kate Toomer has on his mind. There's no love loss here either for those of you if you were just checking in for the first time. This guy might do a moonsault. Oh, oh, there is oh, no way no in way. God's green earth Mike that this is going to happen. Anthony going for the electric chair. Kate Toomer hangs oh, on for as long as he can. God. And down goes the master of Fat Jitsu. Mike Anthony somehow dislodged K Toomer. Here's the cover. Could this be it? Cobra Cup. Mike had K Toomer stacked up all 387 pounds of him. That that look on Mike Anthony's face, that laugh, that smirk. And then meanwhile, on the face of K Toomer, possibly disbelief after taking a huge fall like that. Kate Toomer, excuse me, Ooh. Mike Anthony says, I was this close after field goal kicking Kate Toomer right in the face. It's our opening contest here in week three of Super Bowl. Kate Toomer fighting back. You can see Mike all up in the face and grill of Kate Toomer as he pummels away on him. Big clothesline. And another one as Kate Toomer's trapped in the corner. I don't know about you, Dustin, but I'm fully entranced in this match here. We have saw the buildup here between Mike and Toomer. Mike Anthony pounding away on Kate Toomer fans. We've got to take a quick timeout. Don't you dare go away. This Cobra Cup Finals will return in just a moment. Big kick. Fans, stay with us. The new $1.99 Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps are here for a limited time in bold flavors like Hickory Barbecue or Cheesy Baja. Give yourself some TLC, tender, love, and chicken for only $1.99. Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps. The Memphis Wrestling Fan of the Week is sponsored by Orion Federal Credit Union. Check out all the ways that Orion is redefining banking at orionfcu.com. We aren't just here to see patients. We're here to help people walk out our doors, whether it's life-saving trauma care, advancing oncology treatment, or helping patients reclaim their independence. We're always here for you. Regional One Health, specializing in tomorrows. Join us this Saturday at FedEx Forum for Wrestling Night, featuring the stars of Memphis Wrestling. Enjoy pre-game matches, plus the first 5,000 fans receive a free luchador mask. Get your tickets right now at FedEx Forum Box Office or Grizzlies.com. I'll see you at bell time. Oh, yeah! Welcome back to Memphis Wrestling. Mike Anthony strutting around the ring, taking shots at K. Toomer. Those knee assaults continued throughout the break. And oh, wait a minute. Nobody home. Oh, God. Big oh. shot from K. Toomer. That nearly cleared his head off of his shoulders. Both the men go down. There is a lot at stake here. There's a lot at stake for K. Toomer. There's a lot at stake for the former Memphis Heritage Champion, Mike Anthony, who this for months has been trying to get that title back around his waist, or a year, I should say. K. Toomer, ever since Super Bout II last year, has been fighting, scratching and clawing, knocking people out left and right to get an opportunity at the Memphis Heritage Championship. And this is his chance, but you can see Mike just berating 
talking all sorts of trash in the face of Kate Toomer. Well, you got to give uh, credit where credit is due. Mike Anthony can can back up the talk. There's no doubt there. But the master of fat jitsu this. treating Mike Anthony like a rag doll. Oh, there's the Seismic submission. Toss was blocked, and now we've got that arm and neck triangle choke of some kind. Mike Anthony, as you see, sweeping at the knees of Kate Toomer to take him down. Some great leverage that Mike Anthony has here. We saw him advance in the Cobra Cup tournament using this very submission. Could this be Toomer's what leads down. Mike to the victory here today at Super Bout 3? Could he win? Toomer is down after knocking out all his opponents in Cobra Cup action. But he's not done yet. No, he's not. He sets up. And Mike Anthony. Big kick right to the face. Mike with a splash, trying to get the cover here. Looks like Kate Toomer was able to get his left shoulder up, but just enough room there for Mike to snap back on that hold. Well, let's talk about that hold for just a second, Dustin. When we look at the size of Kate Toomer versus some of his competitors earlier in the Cobra Cup tournament, there's a huge size difference between them and Kate Toomer, which means there's a lot more that Mike has to try to wrap those arms around to oh, secure that hold. Oh, and this is hold. really tough for Mike. It's it taking all the stamina out exactly. of Mike to keep the pressure applied every time K. Toomer takes a breath. 100%. It's supposed to tighten up. But how long can you fight a 387 pounder like that? And I think we're getting our answer right here with a combo kick from K. Toomer. You wouldn't think, oh! oh <laughs> my goodness, 2.5 million people saw it the last time K. Toomer hit one of those kicks. Mike Anthony is down, but letting the referee know that he's still got his wits about him. There's not a single person you can see in the background of the screen that isn't devoting their attention to this match. They are glued. They are wanting the master of Fat Jitsu to earn his black belt, if you will, here in the ring today by securing that Cobra Cup for an opportunity to cash it in. Look at this, face to face, King Cobra's Cup is on the line. This is the finals as K. Toomer with another big combo. Oh, on the Scoops shoulders. Up my, could be the seismic toss. Instead, a big knee to the face of Mike Anthony. K. Toomer with that double chop there. Absolutely crushes Mike Anthony in the corner. Educated feet from K. Toomer. Under the ropes. Oh, God in heaven. Mike might be knocked out. His body just went limp. K. I don't know if Toomer you see that. has knocked out every opponent with that. And he's done. He's knocked out Mike Anthony. We got a winner. He is your winner of the Cobra Cup Tournament. The master of Pet Jitsu, K. Toomer. Let's take a look back at the action on Instant Replay. Brought to you by Memphis Wrestling Live. This Saturday, join us at FedEx Forum. It's wrestling night. You can see the knockout blow. Get those tickets at FedEx Forum or Ticketmaster. However, you get your tickets and you see right there, Memphis wrestling legend King Cobra hands over Cobra's Cup to the new winner and the new victor, the new holder of Cobra's Cup, and it's Kay Coomer, the big man. Well deserved, well deserved. The master of fat jitsu has just, oh, wait a minute, wait, 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 we're not done here. Kay Coomer, Mike Anthony could barely stand. Coomer drops the cup, he's ready for a fight. I don't like this, Dustin. It's a stare down of sorts. Wait a second. Hey. Shine of respect. Is that a fist bump? Mike Anthony with a sign of respect to the big main K. Toomer. And show enough, King Cobra Cup winner, the big main, the master of fat shit through K. Toomer. He's coming to the death. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the 2024 Key Cobra Cup, the 
master of fat jitsu, the big man, K. Toomer. Quick walk off interview here, K. Toomer. King Cobra shakes your hand, hoist your hand in the air. You are the new King Cobra Cup trophy winner and also a sign of respect from Mike Anthony. What's next for K. Toomer? What's next? What's next is that I'm your new Cobra Cup winner. I'm now in possession of the historic Cobra Cup. But I don't plan on holding it for too much longer. Show sure enough. Ladies and gentlemen, K. Toomer says he's not holding that cup very much longer. Stay with us. More Super Bout when we return. The only person I care about is myself right now. Maybe tomorrow I'll be better, but right now I can only focus on myself um, and the people I love who are at home outside of wrestling. I can't focus on these people uh, in wrestling because we all know that there are snakes. Keep your grass cut low because there are snakes, JD. Okay, one more time, I'm gonna offer the room a chance to ask a question of the women's champion, and if, if not, we'll, we'll let her go. Just don't let me down out there, because y'all are my last hope. That's all I've got to say. Every time y'all say MKZ, I really, I really appreciate it, because those people back there, they are liars, and they are cheaters, and they only care about themselves, but you all, y'all come here and y'all buy a ticket. Y'all cheer my name, little girls like you. You wear my headband, you wear my shirts, and that's powerful. Memphis Wrestling is on fire. Join us live this Saturday, March 16th. Don't miss TupeloCon featuring VIP Championship Wrestling with Austin Idol and boxing legend Butterbee. Sunday, March 24th, TNA superstar Hammerstone is coming to Memphis Wrestling Spring Break, presented by Hempville CBD. Reserve your seat today. Saturday and Sunday, April 6th and 7th, watch WWE WrestleMania at Dave & Buster's with us. It's free. Saturday, April 20th, Memphis Wrestling is coming to Little Rock for the Arkansas Travelers Wrestling Night. Get your tickets at milb.com slash Arkansas. Sunday, April 21st, Buff Daddy returns to Memphis Wrestling. All tickets are on sale now. Get yours right now at memphiswrestling.tv. Comics, comics, kapow comics! It's the place for comic books, retro games, classic memorabilia, and more. Kapow Comics, 501-834-5769. Join me, BT, every Saturday after Memphis Wrestling for Rolling Into Mempho Podcast. I thought you've done very, very well together. Well, you know, some people's perception of what very well is, is different, but my perception is not what's been going on as of late. The truth of the matter is, Big Swole has dropped the ball time and time again. Oh. Swole's feeling it today. Big Swole, Justin Cole with a big Swole slam. And that's got to do it. Here are your winners. Big Swole, Colton Cage, and Austin Politalo. You picked this guy to be our partner. Are you talking about Austin? Yeah, Austin. Austin. The problem was not with Austin Swole. The problem was that you you guys get out there in the ring, have a match, squash that beef. We move on as the trio's team that we can be. You did encourage these two men to settle their differences oh, no, no. in the oh, ring. No, no. So hold that thought. I've got some business to go take care of really business. quick. Business. Looks like Colton going? probably going to check on Austin Mullitalo. But whoa, 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 wait a second. Uh, this doesn't look like checking on anything. Oh, what is this? Oh my goodness! What a screw job! You gotta be kidding me! What just happened? Thanks to Colson Cage, I'll tell you that right now! You gotta be kidding me! It's swole! 
getting his shoulders pinned to the mat. What's well, exactly what I said it was, it was a screw job. Swole, you're about as stupid as you look, and you're about as clingy as a dumb old ex-girlfriend. Well, hold on here. How, which one are we talking about here? There's it's many. It's impossible to keep count. But the truth is, you see, you've been lucky enough to have the superstars of seduction one-on-one, -on -one, and now you're dumb enough to take us both on at the same time, buddy, and it is not going to be pretty for you. The following contest is a handicap match. Introducing first, it is the team of Austin Molitalo and Colton Cage, the Walking Red Flags. Walking Red Flags, you can say that again, Terrence. Woo. These two guys have made Big Swole Justin Cole's life a living hell, and Big Swole thinks there's only one way to handle his issues with Austin and Colton. And that's at the same time. Uh, he said they were going to continue uh, stealing wins and kissing tens. Uh, I, just, I don't, know. don't know if I've ever seen any tens with Colton or Austin, but you know, <laughs> let them talk, I guess. They better be scoring one, two, threes, and they better be in a quick hurry because Big Swole Justin Cole will slam them all over the city. Colton, Austin. I knew against my better judgment, I shouldn't have trusted you guys. Every time we had a one-on-one -on -one match, one of you would jump in, would cheat. But today, I got both of you. So for Super Bowl, it's Big Swole, Colton Cage, Austin Molitalo. Forget packing lunch. You're going to need to bring the whole cafeteria, because I'm coming. And introducing next, their opponent, Big! Whoa! Big Swole in the house and looking ready for action Woo. as he sips on his protein powder or pre-workout, whatever it is. I got lightheaded doing that intro. Big Swole headed to the ring with vengeance on his mind. His former friend and tag team partner, Colton Cage, has somehow put Big Swole on a losing streak. And of course, we saw Swole go head to head with the Monster Cool. And in today's main event, will the gun show be able to answer the call and take what's rightfully his? We're going to find out in about 45 minutes. But right now, it's a handicap match. Now, Austin Mullitalo and Colton Cage do have to tag in and out. But this is a way for Big Swole Justin Cole to have both men in the ring at the same time. Very happy that referee Will Gibson and his seniority in terms of... Suplex Wait here. a minute. Colton stops it. Two on one. I mean, they're supposed to tag in and out, but we knew how this would go. And oh. look at that. Big Swole showing his power as he suplexes both men at the same time. Well, that's what you get. Capacity crowd chanting Swole. Swole. They wrote checks Swole. that their butts couldn't cash, and that's what they're paying for today. Swole swings, but Colton able to get out of the way, and Austin Mully Tallow from behind. Now tap dancing on the back of Big Swole. This is a feud that's been going on far too long, and a lot of the fans in the live chat have wondered what's going on with Big Swole. He's lost several in a row after having a nearly one year undefeated streak. What are they doing? They're, they're going back and forth, making these tags to one another. Well, now, if it were you and me in a handicap match well, against Big happen. Swole, we would definitely do the same thing. Listen, you know I can't fight. I'd be bringing a chair and everything else to well, I would never have office. you as a tag team partner other than broadcasting. Oh, gee, oh okay, all right. Well, no offense, but you wouldn't last two seconds in there. <laughs> Speaking of that, Colton Cage better not pay attention to the fans. Colton Cage firmly in control. He better pay attention to Big Swall going for this neck breaker. Oh, Look at wait. this double team. Oh, good oh, Lord. Oh, God. Disgusting. Double neck breaker after the double hip swivel. 
That's a red flag, ladies. Happy anniversary. <laughs> Colton Cade scaling the top rope. We've seen this. Big missile drop kick coming. Oh, oh my oh, God. God in heaven. Misfire. He hits his partner, Colton. Meanwhile, big swell. Counts. <laughs> Down goes Colton. I said he body slammed all over the city. How about that one? for Austin Mullitalo. Big Swole is getting his revenge here today. And this is what we came to see. Colton Cage cost Big Swole the King Cobra Cup. Colton Cage is responsible for all of this. And now finally, face to face. Yeah, you're gonna shake his hand now? Well, he did say uh, earlier before the match that he was bringing the whole cafeteria. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have to worry about packing a lunch. Big Swole and Colton Cage. Doesn't look like we're getting that handshake. Swing and a miss. Big Swole scoops Colton Cage up. Big Swole slam. Down goes Colton. And pins him right in Austin Molitalo's face. Swole with the victory. Here is your winner, Big Whoa. Let's take a look back at the action on Instant Replay brought to you by Kapow Comics Kapow. in Sherwood, Arkansas. Kapow Comics, 501-834-5769. And the Big Swole Slam is always Kapow. <laughs> Was Molly Tolo crying as he left the ring? Big Swole with a huge victory here at Super Bowl 3. And you can hear the fans singing. Whoa, I'll just let them do it, fans. Don't go away. <laughs> Women's division action. It's a grudge match, and it's coming up next. Join us this Saturday at FedEx Forum for Wrestling Night, featuring the stars of Memphis Wrestling. Enjoy pre-game matches, plus the first 5,000 fans receive a free luchador mask. Get your tickets right now at FedEx Forum Box Office or Grizzlies.com. I'll see you at bell time. Oh, yeah! The new $1.99 Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps are here for a limited time in bold flavors like Hickory Barbecue or Cheesy Baja. Give yourself some TLC, tender, love, and chicken for only $1.99. Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps. The Memphis Wrestling Fan of the Week is sponsored by Orion Federal Credit Union. Check out all the ways that Orion is redefining banking at orionfcu.com. We aren't just here to see patients. We're here to help people walk out our doors, whether it's life-saving trauma care, advancing oncology treatment, or helping patients reclaim their independence. We're always here for you. Regional One Health, specializing in tomorrows. Sunday, March 24th, celebrates spring break with TNA superstar Hammerstone, along with the stars of Memphis Wrestling. Memphis Wrestling Spring Break is presented by Hempville CBD. Reserve your seat today at MemphisWrestling.tv. First of all, I'd like to say thank you to all of the great fans out there who sent messages and were thinking about me after I was injured. I wanted to be inside the Wrestle Center today. I wanted to address the fans face to face with an update. I wanted to hear them chant DDT, DDT, but they didn't think it was safe. And just know this, Knicks, I will be back. Diana Taylor, you have been a thorn in my side since the day that I started at Memphis Wrestling. But today, this is over with. So guess what? Your goddess of the night and your queen of Memphis Wrestling is going to leave you a broken husk of a woman. And you can only blame yourself because the goddess of the night always comes out on top. See you soon, Diana. The following contest is set for one fall with a 20-minute time limit. 
making her way to the ring. She is the goddess of the night, Queen Nyx. Nyx is here, and again, this story has been going on way too long. It all started when DDT was injured. Nyx laughed about it, then there was an attack, and then DDT got it back. You saw it just a moment ago, and I cannot wait to see one on one women's division grudge match coming up next. Nyx, I've been here since day one, and today you're gonna find out why they call me Dangerous Diana Taylor. And introducing next, her opponent from Memphis, Tennessee, DDT, Diana Taylor. I think DDT is sending clues to Nyx as she hops and skips out here almost to say my ankle is perfectly fine and today you're gonna pay the dear, dear price. It's DDT and Nyx, two former Memphis Wrestling Women's Champions squaring off with a grudge to settle and here we go. Well, speaking of uh, longevity and long term, Diana Taylor has been with Memphis Wrestling since day one. Remember top of the line banquet hall? Oh my gosh, Ooh. the ceiling tiles that fell. My goodness, DDT is day one-ish. Is that what they say? Yeah, something Just like that. DDT having her way with Nyx, and I love to see it after what Nyx has put DDT through. You saw the history with Ellsworth previously. Big clothesline from DDT, Diana Taylor. Down goes the goddess of the night, Queen Nyx, if you will. And just to recap, too, this is a one-on-one -on -one match. There is no one here at ringside with Nyx. This is to settle the score once and for all between DDT. these two women, these two former Memphis Wrestling Women Champions. DDT hits the floor. It's concrete down here. As you can see, there are no pads. Right into the steel turnbuckle post. Now Nyx having her way. She is a dirty fighter, I'll tell you that right now. Well, DDT is coming back strong here with that face being planted right into the edge of the ring. Oh, watch out the ring steps. And Nyx eats those as well. Head first, I wonder how they taste. As DDT throws Nyx back into the ring, looks to the people and here she comes. Not a lot of not a lot of suggestions we can provide here. Again, just recapping, they are former Memphis Wrestling Women's Champions for a reason. Yeah, DDT goes down with an injury. Nick's happened to be on commentary and and laughed about it. Yeah, one of the most disgusting things I've ever seen. And folks, that was look at this blocked by DDT. That was the reason, like you said, we are here today at Super Bout Three, our our third week of this three week Super Bout spectacular. DDT. If she does hit the DDT, it's O V E R. Nearly Ooh. over right there. DDT with a near fall. Nix is in trouble. DDT has waited a long time through injury and then, of course, jawbreaker. Trying to find the time to get matchmaker King Cobra time in front of him to get this match signed off on. Lover or hater, Nix is one of the most talented and most impressive. Yep competitors in our women's division. And as you can see, DDT is no slouch either. Two of the best performers in the female locker room here at Memphis Wrestling, who have not only went toe to toe. Nicely done by DDT. With other women competitors. There's the cover. But men in the locker room as well too. Near fall right there, very close to the ropes. Nicely done by referee Ron Justice. Got the near fall. Knicks. Oh, wait a minute. Oh! Samoan drop. Wow. Sends DDT down. That seemingly came from nowhere. DDT with a kick out. Ooh. Had to verify referee's hands there to make sure that was a two count. I thought that was, thought that was a three for sure. Nix picks DDT up by the hair, going for a Samoan drop once again, perhaps. No. Locked. Boot. Going for the DDT. And oh, she, she got it! it. That could do it. This could be it, Dustin. We could see this. That's and it. And that's it. DDT gets her vengeance. Here is your winner, DDT, Diana Taylor.
Diana Taylor with a big victory in today's grudge match at Super Bout 3. Fans, we gotta step away for a quick commercial break. When we return, will the Gun Show be able to recapture his Memphis Heritage Championship? Stay with us. Memphis Wrestling is on fire. Join us live this Saturday, March 16th. Don't miss TupeloCon featuring VIP Championship Wrestling with Austin Idol and boxing legend Butterbean. Sunday, March 24th, TNA superstar Hammerstone is coming to Memphis Wrestling. Saturday and Sunday, April 6th and 7th, watch WWE WrestleMania at Dave & Buster's with us. It's free! Saturday, April 20th, Memphis Wrestling is coming to Little Rock for the Arkansas Travelers Wrestling Night. Get your tickets at MILB.com slash Arkansas. Sunday, April 21st, Buff Daddy returns to Memphis Wrestling. All tickets are on sale now. Get yours right now at MemphisWrestling.tv. to Memphis Wrestling! Welcome to the Wrestle Center! Happy third anniversary from your guy Al Capone, Al Capizzi. Oh boy! Congratulations to both of you for a wonderful, successful three years of Memphis Wrestling. Great things happen to great people. My final question is probably the easiest question are you ready? I want to congratulate Maria, Dustin, and everyone in Memphis who have made Memphis Wrestling the success it is. So, from all of us at the United Wrestling Network, happy anniversary. Congratulations, Dustin Star, Memphis Championship Wrestling. Now can you dig that, sucker? I want to take just a second to speak candidly and to speak from our heart. And what I mean by speak from our heart is I mean from my wife Maria, my son Reese the Beast, BKO Brady, and every single man and woman in that locker room and all their family and friends that are here today, we want to say thank you for being here. No, 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 no. Thank you. Welcome back to Ringside. We're wrapping things up here in just a moment on our three week blockbuster super bout anniversary. And there's only one thing left to do. But recapping, we have seen a little bit of everything on our three weeks of super bout coverage. Well, not just that, but the stories leading up to today. Following this journey between the gun show and cruel has been a roller coaster of emotions. And we we're hoping that the gun show will be here today to answer the challenge and to get his title back. That's his title. If you missed what happened between the monster cruel and the gun show, we're gonna take you back real quick. Fans, check this out. As you can see, I might be down, but I'm not out. We've already had an MRI done. I've got like two more weeks and I'll be in the ring again. That's great news. That means that you will be ready for Super Bowl 3 coming up. And I know that you saw that the Monster Cruel won the Grind City Rumble. And it looks like Cruel is headed to Super Bowl 3 to go one-on-one -on -one with you for the Memphis Heritage Championship. Let me tell you something, you big monster. They're saying it for me. I demand 
for gold. Bring me gun show's title. believe the interruption gun show but warning shots have been fired your head needs to be on a swivel because cruel and brooklyn say they're coming for the memphis heritage championship this is my house you won't go home with it i guarantee you that and it's gonna stay here for a long time But man, oh man, maybe not after what's happening right now. I didn't know Cool was even here. Oh, come on, oh, enough's enough. Big choke slam. Absolutely plants the gun show. So we need to get the gun show some help. Oh, he's Wait not a done. Second. He's oh, not God. done yet. What's he gonna do here? Come on! Watch out! Oh my oh. goodness! The monster cruel has taken the Memphis Heritage Championship from the gun show after absolutely destroying him! Welcome back to ringside. You saw the story develop and unfold right before your very eyes. And now it's main event time. Terrence Ward is in the ring for the championship introduction. But wait just a second, folks. It's the big man, the master of Fat Jitsu, K. Toomer, and he's got Cobra's Cup, but He's got the Gun Show's Memphis Heritage Championship as well. What the hell's going on here, Toomer? Toomer has just delivered King Cobra. And he says he's here to take care of business. Fans, don't you dare go away. Our Super Bout 3 main event is coming up next. And what the hell is going on? Hey, Toomer, cashing in King Cobra's Cup? Stay with us! No idea! Join us this Saturday at FedEx Forum for Wrestling Night, featuring the stars of Memphis Wrestling. Enjoy pre-game matches, plus the first 5,000 fans receive a free luchador mask. Get your tickets right now at FedEx Forum Box Office or Grizzlies.com. I'll see you at bell time! Oh yeah! The new $1.99 Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps are here for a limited time in bold flavors like Hickory Barbecue or Cheesy Baja. Give yourself some TLC, tender, love, and chicken for only $1.99. Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps. The Memphis Wrestling Fan of the Week is sponsored by Orion Federal Credit Union. Check out all the ways that Orion is redefining banking at orionfcu.com. We aren't just here to see patients. We're here to help people walk out our doors, whether it's life-saving trauma care, advancing oncology treatment, or helping patients reclaim their independence. We're always here for you. Regional One Health, specializing in tomorrows. Comics, comics, kapow comics! It's the place for comic books, retro games, classic memorabilia, and more. Kapow Comics, 501-834-5769. He 
he's here! The gun show's here! And he better be ready for a fight! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the gun show! idea where the monster cruel is, but Kate Toomer has turned in King Cobra's cup. Kate Toomer has the championship. I don't know what the hell is going on here, but Kate Toomer is standing in the ring with the championship that Cruel had possession of, which is actually the Gun Do Gun Show's title belt. Staring, piercing his eyes through K. Toomer. Capacity crowd excited to see the return of the gun show. And right now, I guess we'll head down to the ring for our championship introduction. Got this for Hands the title over to the gun show. K. Toomer has somehow, someway, gotten a championship, turned it into the gun show, and now we have a championship match. Let's head down to Terrence Moore. The following contest is our main event. And in a special development, the Cobra Cup has been turned in for an opportunity at the Memphis Heritage Championship. Introducing first, the challenger. He is the winner of the 2024 Cobra Cup Tournament from Little Rock, Arkansas, weighing in at 387 pounds, the master of Fat Jitsu, K. Toomer. Somehow, someway, K. Toomer slayed the beast. He returned the championship to the gun show. He won King Cobra's Cup. And introducing at the next of his, his opponent from Gaines City, Tennessee, weighing in at 230 pounds. He is the reigning, defending Memphis Heritage Champion, the Gun Show. The Gun Show is back, and you can see his right arm, his boom arm seems to be bandaged up pretty heavily. And there it is. Referee David Knight hoisting the prestigious Memphis Heritage Championship high over his head. And that is what it's all about. Kay Toomer has somehow, someway, recaptured the Memphis Heritage Championship, returned it to the gun show, and now here we go, a rematch from Super Bout 2. Dustin, I don't know if you can tell I am shaking. I have never. I think Cobra, excuse me, I think K. Toomer, after turning in Cobra's Cup, told the gun show, I got it for you. That's exactly what I took from that as well, so I don't know what that entailed. I don't know how the hell K. Toomer pulled that off, but you know what? He talked about making an opportunity for himself in Memphis Wrestling. He's talked about fighting his way from the fan's chair to the middle of that squared circle. Could today pay off, or could we see the gun show continue his streak for another year as the Heritage Champion? He's been champion over one full year. Now he's face to face with the man that he defeated last year. Regardless of any outside interference, the gun show reigns supreme. Now we have a super bout rematch. The gun show's not 100%, but K. Toomer isn't either. And here we go, no. back and forth. Yeah, it looks like K. Toomer took a lot of damage in our opening match against Mike Anthony. So both of these men are what you could say on equal terms today. We have never seen anyone turn in King Cobra's Cup so quick. Oh. There's a Savat kick. You don't see that often from the gun show. Gun show lariat. Could this be it? Down goes the master of Fat Jitsu. Here we go. Not so and a fast. Near fall. The gun show might have to take this a little more seriously. That was not a very tight cover. The gun show lariat usually ends at one, two, three, but not with K. Toomer. I think, I think he's remembering that. You could see him shaking his head like, okay, okay, I remember this is what it's gonna take. It's 
been a long way back to the top Ooh. for the master of Fat Jitsu. Finally getting his rematch via the Cobra Cup. Nobody home. Big Lariat from the Gun Show. Down goes K Toomer again, and you can oh. see the Gun Show is not 100%. He put his back into that one. Two. Referee, referee, he says it's two, that wasn't three. Almost, almost a three count, but almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades, not in Memphis wrestling. And the gun show did some damage, as you pointed out to himself, with the, putting his back into it, if you will, with that gun show lariat, and now he's taking off the protective wrapping. This is, I don't either. Maybe he feels like it's hindering him, but he might need it. Well, that stability has been removed that he had supporting that arm. Gun show. Oh, got it. Heaven. And we're fighting back. You can hear that. These two men know each other very well. Oh. Gun show. Lariat is blocked. Big K Tumor cutter. Down goes the gun show. Look at the face of K Tumor. These moments don't come very frequently. He is, he's got a second wind here, Dustin. K. Toomer could live in history by capturing the Memphis Heritage Championship right here, right now at Super Bowl three. On if he ropes. hits it, Gun Show might be God knocked cold. Heaven. Is that it? One, two, three, four, it gets two. out two or three. It was that two or was that three? That referee, referee see, David Knight. See that back on instant replay. Looked like he counted it, but he's saying it was two. Instant replay. How close? How close? Referee discretion there. How close could that have been? We almost had a new Heritage champion with that pin. Fans are chanting that was three, and I have to agree with him. But no, referee David Knight calls it off. Big bang. Down goes the gun show! And that's it! We've got a new Memphis Heritage Champion! Here is your winner and new Memphis Wrestling Heritage Champion, the master of Fat Jitsu, K. Toomer! K. Toomer has done it! He's reached the pinnacle! 387 pounder, K Toomer is your new Memphis Heritage Champion. We are all out of time. I am Dustin Starr, he's Terrence Ward, and that is the new Memphis Heritage Champion. So long, everybody.